guys. We got more juicy, stupid Twitter drama focusing on Chibi Reviews the GOAT saying 7,000 people threatened to unalive me over an anime post. So I went to look on, you know, his channel and there's this post he made about Don the Don where the animators didn't need to go so hard in this scene. And let me guess, right? This guy says, he basically quote retweets it and says, petition to stone this guy. It gets 178,000 impressions and nearly 7,000 people like it. Isn't it crazy? How like over fucking anime, just like a random screenshot and Chibi saying the animator didn't need to go so hard for the scene. I get it. Like they're probably focusing on the sexual nature of the scene. Part of me did feel weirded out when she was basically just locked down by these aliens and they're, they're trying to literally, you know, they're trying to grape her, right? They're trying to like take her bananas. What the hell does that mean? But the overall scene did have insane fucking animation and that is the point of it. Then you have random Twitter accounts trying to start shit and I am here to farm it for all we have. Unfortunate, really. I was really enjoying how his post was giving me engagement. I saw a 10k post on it before it was deleted. So this post has violated X's rules. Maybe he didn't delete it. Maybe he got reported and took it down. Other people are saying, now you can call yourself Dr. Stone. Because he's getting stoned. But Chibi, you said the animation of the cartoon looked good. When the image of the character looked like something bad, you know, basically enjoy the real thing. That's right. Chibi Reviews is now a grapist enjoyer because of one single tweet. The logic just makes sense, man. Why did this dude block me and say nothing? He blocks about everyone. Plus, he's unlikable as shit. Bro, giving no clout, it's okay. Listen, a random fucking account. Listen, a random fucking account like this shit. You call this clout? Listen, at the end of the day, I can't really talk shit about like... Twitter engagement because I do not farm Twitter at all. The reason that I'm not active on Twitter is because it's fucking pointless. You're wasting your time. Nobody is actually like logically thinking on this platform. It's just a bunch of mentally ill retards trying to farm imaginary points because they've never achieved anything in their life and they're trying to drag other people down for internet points. That's all this fucking person is. Look at this guy. 7k people, this is the reply right over here. Not gonna lie, dude. You kind of dragging it. And his response is a little SpongeBob. That's literally you. Like, do you think that you're calling this guy out by posting this little baby SpongeBob? You are a fucking dumbass. Just desperate for random fucking internet points. And here's the best part. If you made a video on this trying to start drama, at least you could make some fucking money. But like, you're on Twitter. You don't make any fucking money on Twitter. Even if you get the blue fucking check mark, you try to farm ad revenue, it's insignificant. People waste their own time, their limited time that they have trying to hate others on Twitter so that they can farm imaginary points that does not result in anything. Just a bunch of fucking desperate people that are jealous of other people's brands that they built up for like many, many years and are jealous that they cannot get the same amount of imaginary fucking points. So now I get to come in and fucking dunk on these fucking retards, right? Let's see some other posts here too. Now we got fake images being spread to thanks to yesterday. So there's a little bit of follow-up. There's another account, Xia Lol Haha, where basically this image right here. This is a fabricated thumbnail. This thumbnail isn't real. And they intentionally chose the scene where it was the most suspicious, right? And look at the fucking retards. Kiki then says, he made a whole video? Yup, crying face. And no one's gonna check. No one's gonna fact check. No one cares what the truth is. Stupid children online that doesn't have a job, that has no fucking responsibilities, have all their fucking free time to farm internet points. But unlike me, you don't even monetize yourself. That's the part of where I'm kind of upset at. At least get some fucking value out of it. I'm farming the stupid drama too, but at least I get to make money off of it. You dumb children do nothing here. What are you fucking doing? And look at this screen. Let's, let's look at this fucking Twitter account. Call me Shia, Moose can call me C, artist. You can follow me on TikTok. Another fucking loser that has no brand, no fucking content, just wants to scrape on random imaginary points on Twitter and perfect. My Hero Academia. My, what did I expect? Of course it's My Hero Academia. So basically that's it. That's all that's happening. There's a bunch of stupid children 
that spreads fake news online on Twitter to get imaginary points, then other mentally ill children dogpiles like, this is true, oh my god, then I get to come out on top and farm the fucking videos and actually make some money. This is the thing. If you're gonna do this shit, at least make it fucking funny. If you're gonna try to spit mis misinformation, at least get some fucking value out of it. But what are you fucking doing? You're just getting random Twitter likes and that makes your brain go crazy. That's all you do with your life. You are like the bottom of the barrel trash of fucking society. You don't even know how to fucking farm drama. I'm not even mad that you're posting like spreading fake misinformation. That's what's going to happen when you put your face out there. And Chibi knows, right? This isn't his first intention. This isn't his first example. When you start making content, when you start putting your own opinions out line, online, other people, other retards are going to fucking dogpile you. That's happened to me before too. Random retards that got banned and they're disgruntled because I called them out after they thought that they loved me and I was supposed to be their fucking friend and they realized I don't care about the parasocial shit. They go create an alt account trying to fucking start random drama talking shit in other people's reaction channels. But at the end of the day, none of that shit matters. You know why? Because people understand what the truth is and I get to make videos to make money off of it. Again, the stupid drama I don't really care. I'm more upset that these stupid children think that they're doing something when they could be making YouTube videos and getting more money. But here's the part. They can make YouTube videos out of this. Twitter algorithm, the able, the ability to get your product, you know, your tweets, you know, reach a wider audience. That's why they're, they're on Twitter. They can't do this shit on YouTube. That's why it's just empty fucking clicks.